looking for dick sightings? No. He's not home. I don't know where he is. He's not home. Are you his wife here? Uh, no. <laughs> no, indeed. Okay. I'm busy visiting here. All right. When do we expect him in? I have no idea. The man comes and goes. Okay. Could he be out back at the shed? No. Oh, I don't know what kind of truck he drives. Black truck, yeah. Okay. Oh, he bans it. Yeah. He might be a bear. He might be a bear. My daughter ran into him. She's my granddaughter. Where does his, where's his door? Um, it, he was the first one that said it. Okay, thank you, Sheila. Go get him a fire for him. Anybody else living out there? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry? What do you mean you're sorry? What do you, you have ID or something? We don't have any dealings with you, sir. So you were on my property? Okay, and we left your property. So what are you, so what are you looking for? What does that mean, ma'am? You have your own gun. You have your hands on your gun. Right? You're coming out like an irate lunatic. We're looking for somebody who actually molests little children that was living on this property. Okay? Well, what do you got? Are you police officers or what? We're warrant agents, yes. Okay? What's a warrant agent? We get contracted by companies to go out and execute warrants. Okay, so maybe you should, like, if you want to know. Okay, be careful. You want to. You don't come on my property and just start bullying us around. Who was bullying Nobody anybody? Nobody bullied anybody. Hey, you shut up. I ain't working for you. I'm talking to your son. We were very nice to your son. Was that your son in the car? Yeah. Okay, we were very polite. We pulled up. I saw him. I said, hey, is this the Tidings residence, sir? And I said to your son, and ma'am, no, it's not. It's not. Okay, we're not from this part, okay? And that's the other thing you need to understand. When you say, if you. Okay, that's fine. Ma'am, please don't tell me how to do my job. I don't tell you how to do yours. Sir, when I pulled up and your son was there, I pulled up on side. I said, sir, how you doing? Just ask me, is this a tidy residence? Okay? All right? He pulled up, yes, I pulled up on your grip and saw the car was parked there. I didn't think it was a big issue. I did apologize to your wife, okay? What I will tell you is this. Your son was very polite. You were very polite to him. He said, no, Mr. Uh, Tidings lives in the house up on the road, okay? Right. Now, we saw his trailers and everything for his business down here. So call the police. Okay, so we saw all his trailers down here, okay? So we didn't know. I'll waste my breath if I feel like it. All right. What? How long you guys you walking around the yards in my neighborhood with the hands on That's your fine. You're not and there's a officers. wanted fugitive that was living on this property that has 174 counts of child molestation. I never heard that. You never heard no. that? Uh, anyway, go back and knock on the door. And you're yeah. trespassing on this property, right? No, I'm not. I'm, I got 50 feet. Oh, okay. All right.
that the dispatch? Yeah, I'm standing here talking to you. Yeah, let me speak to him. You want to tell this guy who you are? Yeah, no I problem. On the phone. Who's right here? No problem. We've explained to everybody. No, we talked to him. Right, yeah, talk to please, guys. Dispatch, how are you? Uh, Agent Conwell, U.S. Warrants Enforcement. Um, we have a guy by the name of Robert William McKern Jr., okay, a.k.a. Bob, he goes by. He's one on 174 counts of child molestation and child pornography charges. Um, we're up here. One of This was actually the address where they recovered all of the evidence out of on this matter. The guy has run off, okay. Um, we came up here to speak to them. Uh, the woman got a little irate because I guess they pulled onto her grass, trying to speak to her son. Everything was controlled and polite. Um, then they came up the road. Right. I understand, but ma'am, but if you asked me, I was trying to explain to you, and you came out with an attitude. Your son was was dealing with it just fine, very polite. We were, nobody was interrogating him or bullying him, ma'am. No, so they're concerned. Let me tell you what. I was a victim of violence. Time and time. That's why I'm like. Okay, and I understand, so you, and that makes sense, and I understand that. Now I, I get I don't it. Want anybody on my okay, ma'am, I get that. I was a victim of a violent home invasion. Okay. All right, so she's a victim, and that's why they're alerted. That apparently, yeah. that's what's coming on now. Um, no, we don't know. We're trying to speak to the homeowner, okay? And they're they're playing, you know. They she's trying to play, you know, civilian activist for them, and we're just, you know, we're just trying to make contact to find out exactly what what his relationship to him was, how long he, you know, if there's any mail coming here for him, if he's heard from him or anything. No, no, we're a private entity, okay? We do through bail bonds, insurance companies, and you know, law enforcement when they contract us, okay? Yeah, you want to send a unit out? I'd be more than happy to talk to them. Absolutely. Appreciate that very much, sir. Thank you. Yeah, just so you know. That makes me feel bad. This guy That's here, this guy here, okay, well, I'll tell you right now. I don't know. Who yeah, well, he was living here, and apparently the workshop, he's got that. Here, okay? That's not Mr. Titus. No, we know that. Mr. Titus had this guy working for him, oh, okay. okay? When he got caught with the 15-year-old girl, okay, the cops came back here, went through the, the whatever the shed is or the garage that he was living above at the time, Okay, and recovered the camera that had all of the child pornography images on it. That's not no, that's what I tried to explain well, to you. No, you were you asked for Mr. Tidings. Right, we asked where Mr. Tidings was, but you weren't. My concern is the young children in this area, and when I come up right. here, that's the Well, family obviously, guns. We'll we'll but, right, but we don't know what we're getting into, number one. You guys are pulling up, okay, before the cars even stopped, you're yelling out the window already. Well, okay? Yeah. This, this was a. Right. a yeah. Is on the phone. Oh, fine, take it. So that was the whole situation. Which you're not a police officer, so you're not in police uniform. We don't have to be. I know, but we would be what my that's truck does exactly what we do. Oh, well, I didn't see what. All right, so you weren't out there. Okay. We, like I said, we're not trying to hide anything. We came up very politely and asked, you know. Obviously, if, this is, if everybody's so concerned about children and what, okay, this guy has a 15-year-old girl living with him that he, is a runaway that he's filming and having somebody film, you know, video footage and pornography and all this other crap. I mean, yeah, I'll give you a copy of this. Go, go on your computer. Go on your computer and just Google it there. Yeah. I thought you said Tidings you said molest No, no. He, tidings, he worked for Tidings, okay? Oh. That was the whole thing. Okay. He worked here, and when, they, when he got arrested, okay, they found all of the evidence in whatever the garage or the shed that he had, that's where all the evidence came out of. Okay. He worked for Tidings for apparently a few years, off and on, okay? And like I said, I, yeah, we're talking, he's been on the run for two years now, okay? So it would have been prior to... What did I, I just like I said, you heard it. We want to speak to Mr. Tidings. Okay, okay, so that requires hands on guns, all but of you that. Have the phone. I mean, that just doesn't make sense. I don't know. I just, that just. Yeah, they're on the phone. No, ma'am, you coming up as an irate person with something in your hand from a distance that I don't know if it's a knife oh, or whatever. Okay. I know, but you're a victim of violence, so you would know that you have to take caution. Well, I appreciate it if you would leave. It doesn't concern you at this point. Okay, we've answered all of your questions. You've been more than respectful to all your parties. All right? Oh, 
Oh, Miss Titus coming back? Oh, okay. Cool. Oh, okay.